Greetings, my name is Ogihara and I'm from the PES production team in Japan. We're getting ready to launch Pro Evolution Soccer 2014. So I wanted to tell you about some of the new features and let you know what we're working on. We've listened to the comments from the PES community and made an effort to implement a lot of the feedback into PES. We thought about the capabilities of the current generation hardware and features we'd like to build upon in future games. So we decided to create the game from scratch, beginning with the engine. We're using the Fox engine from Kojima Productions as the core of our game and used it to create new features we hope you enjoy in PES 2014. First, I'd like to talk about the new features of PES. PES 2014 is reborn. In this new game, we want to showcase all the wonders of a soccer game by focusing on the authenticity of how people play, how they control the ball, and the passion users show in each game. The goal was to bring authenticity, technical superiority, and passion, bringing the personality of each player to the game. When we started to think about how to develop this game, we decided it was important to return to the basic fundamentals of football. I mentioned the Fox Engine, which is a graphical engine being used for most of the major Konami games. We transformed the engine to create a soccer game. Let's talk about the visuals. In the past, we've received a lot of praise by how realistic our game looks. Though honored, we are not satisfied. So we've invested in enhancing all the visuals, from facial expressions, hair, sweat, grass on the field, and even the uniforms and we believe we've come up with something astonishing. I recommend you even watch the game in slow motion to pick up just how detailed the game is. We enhance not just the player's faces, but as I mentioned, details like expressions, sweat, and hair. Details like the uniform. From the logos, fabrics, and colors, all are lifelike. Even dirt will play a role as uniforms get dirtier as the game goes along. The best way to see this level of detail is to watch the game replays in slow motion. We think you'll be pleased. When we talk about the fundamentals of football, we started with the visuals. We used the Fox engine to enhance the details of facial expressions, how players smile, sweat, and even the dirt on the uniforms. But we also built upon the PES ID feature we brought in last year, in PES 2013. We went into great detail to recreate how players faint, run, celebrate, react, dribble, and every other identifiable trait. In PES 2014, we've doubled the animations and characteristics from your star players. We've put in Fred from Fluminense's shoot and block technique, and goal celebrations from Monchijo of Santos, Raquelme of Boca Juniors, and Gutierrez of Universidad of Chile. The new engine allowed us to bring new features to the game. Up until now, we always controlled the game from the viewpoint of the player. You controlled the person. This year, we focused on not just the player, but also the ball. Now, you control the player, but also have to make sure to control the ball. The ball has its own physics, so this allows players to have greater freedom over how to control the ball, whether in air, off the dribble, or with feints. We've also improved the physics and AI of the game. We call this mass system motion action stability system. With this system, you will feel the impact of body contact, greater collision detection, and more realistic reactions to defender challenges. We believe it's important to recreate the feelings and emotion of a real-life match, whether you're watching or playing, from the fans to the coaches to the players. So we've come up with this feature called Giant Killing. The passion component plays such a major part of any football game. For instance, if you have a smaller team going against a major team, you have the ability to beat them. With the right stadium, right energy and momentum, any team can be beaten. Now let's talk about online. Creating PES 2014 gave us a great chance to improve the game. And to be honest, it was a challenge as well. Having 10 months to build a game with the new engine gave us a very aggressive schedule but we're happy with what we've been able to do. For players connecting online, when you put the game in for the first time, you'll be prompted to download an update. This update will unlock some key online features, such
such as the ranking match, match lobby, and Master League Online modes. In the coming weeks, we'll release a second update that will bring the 11 vs 11 mode, as well as some cosmetic changes, such as improved facial animations and bug fixes. We want to make sure the most popular modes are available at launch. We also want to give you a great game. So understand sometimes we have to make tough decisions. We know online play is important to our community, so we apologize for any inconvenience this will cause you. We look forward to hearing your feedback, both on and offline. Thanks for listening.